Hello, Adam Rayner, Talk Audio TV. This is Gadget Show Live Professional Day. And I've started off on the Alpine stand, and this is Mr. Atsuhiro Takeda of Alpine. Hello, Atsu. Hello. Um, tell us about this lovely R32. I believe you were saying this is the third different install this car's had? That's right, we've had the Golf uh, since 2005. So it's a 55 plate car. We've had it for several years. Debated whether we should sell it or should we keep it and try and get it refreshed. It's been underused uh, for the last uh, few years, so it's nice to see a, a new install again. Got up to extremely high standard by our friends at Oxford Car Audio. That's uh, uh, so Steve Lem Lemazure and uh, and his mates. Is that Mark and Tony there at Oxford Car Audio? That's right, yes. Yeah, they're top blokes. So uh, they've done a fantastic job. Just to quickly run through what uh, what's happened. We've now got an 8-inch uh, screen now, INEW928R, which uh, is our DVD, Bluetooth and navigation unit. And then kept it simple. In the doors, we have uh, high bar components, SBR60C. Um, but the door's not finished yet. There are more changes afoot. Yeah, yeah. Where the Alpine logo you see here, that's a temporary addition because we're going to fit a Type R 18 subwoofer in the doors, so that should be uh, pretty impressive when that's done. Wow, what, where the Alpine thing is? Yes, that's right. So uh, we we'll see a sub in there. Another neat little touch that was done, uh, Steve Lem's done for us is just to finish the uh, the trims off. That was, was like an aluminium finish, a silver finished car. Now it's a body coloured, and that's a sort of fresh, freshened it up a bit inside the car. That the sounds, sounds like, yeah, absolutely. Yes, kind of in the boot. Here we go, coming outside of the uh, R32. And if we uh, just leap round here, uh, we've got a couple of your colleagues. This is uh, Erica Hello. and Sarah. Hello, Erica. You Hi. Right, mate? Hi. Good, thank you. And uh, Sarah Widdowson. Hello. She's my mate on Facebook. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys are here helping out uh, on the whole promo effort for the, uh, the full week of Gadget Show, yeah? Yes, we are. We're here until Sunday. Yes, I do hope your smiles are as shiny and happy looking on Sunday. I'm sure they will be. That's, a, <laughs> that's the plot, isn't it? <laughs> Meanwhile, actually, show us the, uh, the tech in the boot of this here car sound. It's flashing lights. It's famous. OK, so we have three amplifiers. We have two MRX M110 uh, monoblock amplifiers, each amp running two subs. They're shallow uh, Type R's, SWRT12s. We have this uh, window here, and the reason for that is that you can actually see the other side of the subwoofer to see how shallow it is. So it's a neat little touch, plus it adds a bit of colour and a nice Alpine logo inside. Well, let's go in there, let's go on in and see if we can see into this box. So, let's see, look, 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 look this. Just barely catch the bottom of the, uh, the roof is in there. The workmanship's awesome. And the nice thing uh, about it is the actual subwoofers, we didn't want uh, people to be touching the cones. If you have a show car, generally people put their hands on the subwoofer cone. Yes. Um, but the actual material of the cone is quite delicate, so we wanted the grills on it. Now, there was a big resistance from the, uh, the installers to put grills, yeah, saying yeah. Oh, it won't look very nice. Yes. Um, but uh, due to the practical nature of being a show car, we had to put the grills on. Having said that, with the uh, extra work that's gone into it with the LEDs, I think uh, it actually finishes it off quite nicely and it does look different to most other installs. It's one of the most uh, blingy Alpine installs I've seen in ages. Gorgeous and uh, well, you can get to see it at Gadget Show Live. I believe there's still tickets available so uh, if I can get this up on the internet good and fast, we might even get a few more bodies down to see you. But uh, with uh, Sarah Willison and uh, lovely Erica Dancer. I'm sorry to be reading your label there, Erica, I do apologise. And of course, Atahira Takeda. Signing out for Talk Audio TV. Thanks ever so much, guys. Have a wicked show. Thank you.